Hello guys and welcome back. In this video, we'll be implementing signing a user up or register registering a user using email address and password. So um, it's again pretty straightforward. Uh, let's just go back to the application here and uh, in here, let's create a method for that. So sign up. Okay, and this is going to call AF auths. Um, create user with email and password method and this requires an email and password so email and password and again if we hover over this it returns a promise with user credentials so we can essentially do the same thing that we are doing with the other methods but we don't really have email and password at this point. So I'm going to define them on the template. We don't really need the title. So I'm going to get rid of that. So email is going to be a string and so is password. Let's save that. And at the back of this uh, in the method, we'll be using these uh, two variables the email and the password let's save that and now in here inside this row let's uh, let's close this and here we have the email and password now we'll be using ng model but to use ng model we will need to import the forms module inside the app module so let's do that forms module and this must be imported from um, import forms module from at angular slash forms okay and let me place a comma as well over here let's save that and i'll now go back to the application and i will be using ng model let's bind that two ways and this would be email and i'll do the same for a uh, password so ng model and this would be binded with password like so Let's save that and go back to the application to see how it looks like. So uh, let me sign in using an email. So email um, say 10 at example.com and let me s type in the password and sign up. Now this won't really do anything because we haven't really binded the sign up uh, button. So click and this should call the sign up method like so. Let's save that and go back to the application and check um, if it works now. Example 10 at domain or maybe email 10 at example.com and the password let me just sign up and uh, it signed me up now this particular user doesn't really have uh, an email address as uh, sorry uh, this user doesn't really have uh, other details like uh, name and image so those won't be available to me but this particular email is now registered and on this particular um, credential you can now log the user in so this was it regarding uh, creating a new user with uh, email address and password in the next video we'll talk about logging the user in with email address and password so i'll see you guys in the next video